Well, basically, by signing the MMO, you're becoming signatory A. As I've indicated, um, it would mean that other jurisdictions would be looking more uh, into the Ghana capital market. Uh, it, because basically, if there's going to be some transaction and if there is an issue, there'll be the need for the regulator, that's SEC Ghana, to cooperate um, with them. So basically, it's just about uh, continuing doing our work and doing well. Market operators uh, should remember that we are not just competing with um, ourselves locally, but uh, the competition is global. So employing global best practice standards, I think is key. So for those that are already doing that, continue doing that. For those that are not so much measuring up to um, you know, the best practices, uh, they need to do so because um, we will be getting various entities looking more into the uh, space here in Ghana, the securities industry space here in Ghana. So uh, just let's get our act right and let's position ourselves uh, to interact more. IOSCO, which is the International Organization of Securities Commission uh, Organization, is a global standard setter for securities market regulators in the world. And basically, they set various standards to facilitate cooperation. As you may know, given globalization, we can talk about strict boundaries when it comes to financial flows and financial transactions. So it's important for various jurisdictions to be able to share information that would help in regulation uh, because things like market manipulation, uh, fraud, insider trading, and other things that come up within the securities industry space, there is a need for information sharing and collaboration. So basically, the IOSCO uh, sets these standards all geared towards ensuring that securities regulators uh, do uh, a, a good job in terms of protecting investors, protecting the uh, integrity of the market by making sure that they